What does a Throttle Position Sensor TPS do? The Throttle Position Sensor TPS is a vital component in a car's engine management system that plays a crucial role in ensuring proper engine performance and fuel efficiency. It is responsible for monitoring the position of the throttle valve and relaying this information to the Engine Control Unit ECU. In this video, we will delve into the functions of the throttle position sensor, its significance in the operation of a vehicle, and how it affects engine performance. So, before starting the video please like this video. Do subscribe and turn on the notification to our channel for future updates. 1. Throttle Valve Control The throttle position sensor is directly linked to the throttle valve, also known as the throttle plate or butterfly valve which is located in the throttle body of the engine. The throttle valve controls the amount of air that enters the engine. 2. Dot monitoring throttle position The primary function of the throttle position sensor is to monitor the position of the throttle valve. It does so by measuring the angle or position of the throttle plate as it opens and closes. 3. Dot informing the engine control unit ECU The information gathered by the TPS is relayed to the engine control unit ECU, in real time. The ECU is the brain of the vehicle's engine management system, responsible for making critical decisions related to fuel injection, ignition timing, and various other parameters that affect engine performance and emissions. For dot engine response and fuel delivery. Based on the data received from the throttle position sensor, the ECU adjusts the engine's fuel delivery and ignition timing. The key functions affected by the TPS data include Air fuel mixture. The ECU uses TPS data to determine the appropriate air fuel mixture for the engine's operating conditions. When the throttle is opened wide, as an acceleration, more fuel is injected to match the increased airflow. Conversely, when the throttle is closed, during deceleration or idling, fuel injection is reduced to maintain fuel efficiency. Engine load. The TPS helps the ECU calculate the engine's load. This information is crucial for optimizing performance and efficiency. For instance, a wide-open throttle indicates high engine load, which may prompt the ECU to downshift for more power. 5. Dot improved performance and efficiency The throttle position sensor significantly contributes to improved engine performance and fuel efficiency. Here's how. Responsiveness The TPS enables rapid and precise throttle response. When you press the accelerator pedal, the TPS data allows the ECU to react quickly, delivering the right amount of fuel and air for optimal acceleration. Fuel efficiency. By continuously monitoring the throttle position and adjusting the air-fuel mixture accordingly, the TPS helps maximize fuel efficiency. It ensures that the engine operates as efficiently as possible under different loads and driving scenarios. 6. Common TPS issues. Over time, the throttle position sensor may develop issues that affect its performance. Common problems include Wear and tear. Like many electronic components, the TPS can wear out over time due to regular use and exposure to heat and engine vibrations. Electrical issues, wiring problems, loose connections, or damaged connectors can interfere with the TPS's ability to transmit accurate data to the ECU. In conclusion, the throttle position sensor is a critical component of a car's engine management system that monitors the position of the throttle valve and relays this information to the engine control unit ECU. The ECU uses data from the TPS to adjust fuel delivery and ignition timing, optimizing engine performance and fuel efficiency. A properly functioning TPS ensures rapid throttle response smooth transitions between driving conditions, and efficient operation. Regular maintenance and timely repairs are essential to keep the TPS and the overall engine management system in optimal condition. What do you think of our video? Let us know in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from us again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.